Learning Mitzvos in Action with Torah Box. Hafrashat Chala, separating the dough, is a mitzvah from the Torah which entails to separate a portion of dough after kneading it by saying a blessing beforehand. This mitzvah allows us to repair the sin of Adam HaRishon by sanctifying the material which is represented by bread. One will separate dough only if it is made out of the following five grains. Wheat, barley, rye, oat, or spelt. A dough containing less than 1.2 kilogram of flour is exempted from any separation. Between 1.2 kilogram and 1.56 kilogram of flour, one will separate the dough without a blessing. More than 1.56 kilogram, one will separate with a blessing. The mitzvah of separating challah is incumbent on both men and women. Yet the custom is that the women are entrusted to do so. Nonetheless, it is advised that men separate the dough as well at least once a year. Before saying the blessing, it is imperative that one's hands are clean because when kneading dough, bits of flour may stick to one's fingers. Before separating the dough, it is customary to give money to tzedakah. After separating the dough, one says the following blessing. Baruch ato Adonai Elokeinu Melech Ha'olam Asher Kedishanu B'mitzvah Yisav V'tzivanu Lehafrish Chala One then takes a piece, regardless of the quantity, Ashkenazim, separate the dough before the blessing, then, while taking the piece, one says, Hare zu chala. This is chala. After reciting the blessing, it is good to pray, since this is an auspicious time for divine kindness. It is prohibited to benefit from the separated peace, since it is imbued with holiness. After separating a piece, burn it. Usually on the stove top, you can wrap it several times with aluminum foil and cook it in the oven with the challah, or you can put it in two plastic bags and throw it in the garbage. <laughs> Oh, you behave.